So if you guys look at this, here is my advice for doing problems like this, because you will have these on the quiz. You're also going to have these on the test. They're going to come up. If you're given information, graph it. We know that a focus and a vertex are points, and a directrix is a line. Correct? Yes? So plot the information. Focus, 2, 0. Vertex, 0, 0. And not only plot the information, but label it. Label the information. Because now, you guys don't need to know much about conic sections, except that you remember that a parabola always opens up away from its focus or towards its focus? Towards. towards. So you guys should know the parabola looks like this. I don't know what the equation is. That's what the question is. But you guys should know that that's what the parabola is going to look like. And there's some directrix here. Because the directrix, remember, the, the vertex is right in between the focus and the directrix. So the distance to the focus is the exact same distance to the directrix, just in the opposite direction. Opposite direction. Okay. So if you go 2 to the focus, you go 2 in the opposite direction to get to the directrix. Make sense? But the problem is we don't know what the equation is. But that's OK, because we know what the vertex is. That's h, and that's k. We have a horizontal parabola, so that's our equation. Right? That's our equation of our horizontal parabola. Um, the vertical parabola, oh, I guess I never gave you guys that vertical parabola, did I? Yeah, well, 4p. OK, well, I'll rewrite it for you. Um, we'll, do, we'll do, actually, the next one I'll make sure I do in, as a vertical. Um, so therefore, this one's going to be y minus k squared equals 4p times x minus h. So we know k and h are 0, 0. The problem is we don't know what p is, or do we? What does p represent again? p represents the distance. The p represents the distance from the vertex to the focus. How far is that? 2. In what direction, positive or negative direction? Positive. So it's positive 2. So our final equation, ladies and gentlemen, is y squared equals 8x. Done.